three as well. Rain Burdung coils again, and that did tail in late. Lovely drive by Street, and that will be his 50. For the eighth time at first class level, a punch to mid on for one. Sittle bowls again to Kawaja, who's edging between slip and gully with soft hands. It's going to hurtle towards the rope, and it will get there. Siddle starting a new over bowling oh. to Street, who gets an edge. And for the second time off the bowling of Peter Siddle in consecutive overs. Rainbird here bowls. Yeah, leg side. Oh, that's a fantastic catch. Brilliant catch by Ben McDermott. Here he is again. And Street does drive at this one and picks the gap. And that's a good shot. And it will reach the rope. It's teased Freeman. Too much of a difference in being able to play it. Oh, Street's gone big here. He's lifted him over the mid-wicket region. Mel Smith bowls now to Renshaw from the stumps. Flicks it away nicely. That's a stylish shot. From a stylish player. Freeman again bowls. Renshaw's hit on the pad. That's close. That's really close. It's more than close. It's out. Freeman gets his second wicket. One century, 1350s. As uh, that bit of in-dip from Siddle and helped on its way. It's a lovely Siddle on the runway again. Wide of the crease and just got the radar wrong. Drifted onto the pads and well picked off. Lovely shot off the toes by Jimmy Pearson. Webster in again, a leg stump line, low full toss in the end, and Pearson puts it away, whips it off his pads. Short ball, Pearson effortlessly swings into a pull shot again. Terrific placement, and he's only on 92. Webster in again, gives that a bit more air. Street goes over the top, and there's no one at long on, and that has gone the journey. Rainbird again, and Street gets his ton on the back foot. He punches through the covers. And they pick up a couple. And Bryce Street, in just his 17th first-class game, has registered his fourth Sheffield Shield century. An understated celebration. Down four. Rain Bird in again. Once more, punching off the back foot. And this time, putting it away. Placement excellent again. In the match in about seven and a half sessions. The big edge there from Pearson, aiming the huge cover drive. Aggression this time. He hasn't quite hit that one as well as he would have liked, but it's still gone far enough for six. Pearson cutting over the top of the slip cord, and there's no slips there, but it's gone for four. Freeman round the wicket, and Pearson is carving rather than cutting, and there's no sweeper out there now, so he'll pick up a boundary. Freeman in again, and it's a nice push Ooh, deal. Sure. In fact, that's another boundary. So uh, that's a lovely off drive again. You've already got him. Pearson slaps that one through the covers. That's, that's a, a good, good shot. shot. Draws the so if you're scoring them under pressure, if you're showing them oh the dear. Tent, the oh dear. <laughs> that wasn't too good. That's an oh dear ball. <laughs> that's been hit for four. Two overs each. Well, that's a nice shot. That's a great shot. That's a really good shot there from straight. That will get to the rope. Bowling to Pearson. It's another terrible ball that's been hit into the deep and crashing medium pace and he's with street again who's driving hard into the pitch oh, oh. And he's beaten both mid on and mid off and i wonder whether they got in each other's eye line it's slowing up will it reach the rope at will as uh, rainbow bowls again that's an edge and it's a catch and street's innings has come to an end he is edged into the gully here's rainbird again short ball Pearson gets underneath it, lofts it out to deep mid-wicket and brings up his century in style. What an innings. He takes the lid off, raises the bat, a broad grin, acknowledges the warm applause from his... And now he edges Rainbird, and that four will more. go to the boundary for his 13th for Streaky. The declaration... My faith has been restored in Queensland. We're all Trigger. happy again, Merv. Mate, that, that's Game a, on. That's a great declaration because it looked as though Queensland had just stopped and they weren't scoring runs. If they're scoring quick runs, you think, right, keep it going. Queensland is making their way out to the middle. So here we go. Michael Nisa, first ball of Tassie's second innings. And there's an edge through the cordon and it races down to the third man. The rest of the day, everything to play for. He's in again. Jewel throws the hands at that and slaps it through the covers. Stay okay. Over pitching on that occasion is Nisa and Ward cashes in. A man in form, 144 in the first dig. A little bit of a giggle at this. 
And although he struck Jewel on the pad, Renshaw pleading with the umpire. And he's going to be bowling here to Ward, who swings him high and over the top in the onside, and that'll go down to the boundary for four. As Kuhneman bowls here to Jewel, who cuts, and he cuts well. Got it behind point, out into open territory, Oy. and it's four. Kuhneman here. Oh, the Oy. reverse. The reverse from the young New South Welshman, now Tasmanian. We, we can contain it. Oh, bang. Oh, that's a big hit again. Down the ground by Ward. And that's another boundary. Kuhneman once more. Oh, oh that's, that's the one. And out, yes. Caleb Jewell trapped leg before. That spun back a long way. Kuhneman comes in, bowls to Ward, who defends away on the bounce to Renshaw, and that will be Stumps on day three. Queensland's 10 wickets tomorrow. So it does shape as a, an intriguing day.